Hello my philosophers and welcome back from the weekend. Well we're still kind of in a sunny and social vibration for the Sagas, that's because the moon continues in Libra and this morning, at least in the United States, we wake up to a soul pyramid in the air signs. Now if you're new to Soul Garden, a soul pyramid basically unites three areas of your consciousness through a gravity triangle. Ooh, watch the Astro Weather for what that means. But it does mean that emotionally today, I think your heart and your marriages and your social life are all working together. You're going to find a synergy, maybe a big picture realization. If nothing else, I think you're going to start to feel really happy about your new unions. That's because Mars is pushing really hard in the house of marriage. It's really about to move now into the next sector of consciousness. We'll talk about that. So really, in the last, well, let's say six weeks, there's been progress, but prior to that, it was begun. These are relationships that you started developing probably last fall, but they got stalled over the holidays. That stall, by the way, was a Mars retrograde. And now it's moving forward, and I think this soul pyramid is making all sides really feel that. The moon really is still in the sector of consciousness of your friends and your own reputation in society. Mars is in the house of marriage. And then Neptune is a third part of the pyramid in the house of communication. So a lot of thinking, a lot of talking, a lot of important conversations going on. Now this afternoon, however, I do expect it to get cloudy and overcast for you. I expect Sagittarians to maybe be uh, in that slight possibility of mopiness. You know what I'm talking about. So be cautious. And if you really want proof of astrology, compare your happiness this morning to your mood in the afternoon. That's the moon moving into your subconscious. And if you're not happy, I'll tell you right now, it's something in your subconscious. So most likely after this big spout of happiness and Jupiter energy, you're going to spend the next two days really emotionally processing any subconscious sabotages or triggers or old me uh, memories from this life or even a past one that could perhaps pull apart these new unions. So always working with the universe. All right, Sagittarius, that's all I got for the day. I'll see you tomorrow with more Soul Horoscopes. Live, love, be.